Hello friends, I'm back with another song and this song as you can see it's a little bit more complicated now. I'm going to go up to the more advanced song to teach you guys now. And this is only one of the few more songs that I'm going to write a uh, note for the, the name of the note on the paper for you. As you can see a lot of scribbling on there and um, also the finger for you. Um, in the as you get even further, I'm only gonna help you with the fingering, and even so, uh, you still have to uh, learn to figure out the fingering for for yourself a little bit better because each person's hand is very okay. Um, the flexibility is different and all that. So finger a little thinner, longer, uh, fatter, shorter. So I'm just I'm just gonna do my best here. All right. So this song is quite long. Um, let's see how many, that's 16, uh, 16 measure along on this line, and then another, wow, another 17 on the bottom. So this song along is quite long, so we're going to break into eight part, okay? Now, for those of you who have no idea what I'm talking about here, please feel free to go and watch my piano music note video as well as the finger exercise uh, part one video and also um, other um, you might try the other easier song so it give you until you get a hang of it and you can start go ahead and try this song okay again so I'm not gonna explain it uh, that much further I'm gonna zoom it in and we're gonna start right away because this song is gonna be very long and I don't think we have time to uh, to, uh, to really explain it that much for you, but um, I'll do my best, okay? All right, we're going to take uh, four measure at a time here, okay? All right, as you can see, the bottom line is for your left hand, the top line is for your right hand, bass clef, treble clef, as I repeated many times, and this is your time signature. It's telling you that there's four quarter note in one measure. So as you can see right here, one, two, three, four. That's a quarter rest, and this is a whole rest. Whole rest means four beats, quarter rest, one beat. And this one is, uh, you see a half note with a dotted, they call it dotted half note. So the, uh, this kind of note is have three beats. So one here, three plus one is four. And this one whole note, okay? So that's four beats in and of itself. So that's why you see it stand alone here. And next one you see four quarter note, and then two half note. And as you see two half note here, but you notice something. There's another quarter note that you see cross out. It's the same note. It's an A4, but it tied together. So that means you have to play one time, but hold for three beats, for three count. And then you play the next note. And down here for the left hand, there's a whole note here. That's four beats in and of itself and then you tie to another same note, also four beat. Now it become eight beat, as I wrote, oops. Okay, sorry about that. So as I um, pointed out for you here, I should be a little bit gentler here, okay? As you can see that now, all right? So let's tackle um, the left hand first. Like I said, you go on to note C3, and then finger five with your pinky, and then next E3, F3, just follow that, okay? And then like I said, when you hit this note, you have to hold for eight count, all right? I'm gonna let you hear it first, and then I'm gonna zoom out. So, because left hand doesn't have anything here, so I'm gonna start right here, okay? So, two, three, four, two, two, oop, for, forgive me, let me try it again. Two, three, four, two, 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 three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay? All right. So that's for your left hand. And let me zoom out. And you can see how I play on the piano. Okay? And it's going to be like this. Two, three, four, two, 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 
three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay? Okay, that's the that's your left hand. Now let me zoom in for your right hand. Okay, your right hand you're gonna be start on G4. Look for note G4, find it. If you don't know how to find it, then you need to watch my uh, piano music note video. It would help you figure it out. Okay? I teach on there method to recognize your note. All right? So put finger three on G4. All right? And of course, if that's so, then your finger one thumb on your right hand will go on to E4. So and so. Okay? So it's going to sound like this. Okay, because this one you have to hold for three B. All right. Okay, so let me zoom out, and you can see my right hand gonna be on G, on G to G four right here. Okay, so. Okay? Alright. Now let's put both hands together. Your right hand gonna be right here. Your left hand gonna be right here. Previous song, your right hand was here on C4, right? But now it's different now. Okay? This is more advanced now. Okay? So your hand have to move around. So that's it. One more time. Okay. All right. So let's bring it closer, and let me explain the second um, the second part of this. Okay. All right. Hope you can see better clean. All right. So the next one, you're going to play on A4. Okay, for those of you who didn't see A4, you see right here, A4. So that's the same note, A4, and then G4, E4, and then on. This one again. Because this is four beat, it tied to one beat. So it become five beat. You don't play that. Okay, the same here. Okay? All right. Your left hand is easy enough. Okay? So your left hand come with uh, pinky on C3, okay, for four beat. Two, three, four, and finger one on G3 for four beat. Two, three, four, and come back to C3 again for five beat. Right here. One, two, three, four, five, okay, and let go, okay? All right. Now your your right hand, you're gonna have to play like this. Two, three. Two, three, four, five. Okay? Alright, let me zoom out. And I'm gonna play for you. So I'll push it up so you can see. All right. So left hand's easy. Just two, three, four. Two, three, four. Two, three, four, five. Okay. All right. Now your right hand have to be on finger four on A four. It's gonna be like this. Two, three. Five. Okay? Alright. Now let me play both hands together. Okay? Alright. So let's go to the next. Feel free to pause the video or rewind it. 
at your own convenience, okay? And if you do need the sheet itself, then feel free to shoot me an email, but have to follow my instruction. Otherwise, I'm not going I'm going to ignore your email, okay? I will put the description, please read the description and the instruction in the description and along with um, other link uh, to the video that you need to know. Okay, I will put that into the description of this video. And feel free to drop me a comment or questions, okay? All right. So we go on to the next four now. This because left hand is rested here, so I'm, uh, I'm going to play uh, the next ver uh, measure here, okay? So it's going to be finger five on C3 for four beat. Two, three, four, and a finger three on E3. Two, and then finger two on F3. Two, and then one more time. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay? That's for your left hand. Now for your right hand, the same thing. Your finger three is still on G4, like beginning, no change. Okay? All right, let me zoom out. Gonna play this one for because this rest, so I'm gonna play right here. Two, three, four, two, 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 three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay? And then right hand, two, three, two, two, three. Okay? All right. Now let's put both hands together. I'm going to play from right here to here. Okay? One more time. Okay? All right. Let's go to the last measure, last four measure of the first line. Okay. So this one's simple enough. It's very similar to the second... Uh, Second measure, uh, second, uh, I don't know, the second group that I was uh, playing for you. All right, so your left hand on C3, finger five, pinky on C3. If you don't know what C3 is, then you need to watch the other video. Two, three, four, uh, and one on G3 now. Two, three, four, back to C3 again. This five beat, two, three, four, five, okay? And then left hand still on G3, third finger on G3, on G4, I'm sorry, and fourth finger on A4, okay? So it's gonna be like this. Two, three. Two, three, four, five, okay? And let me zoom out. And this is how you're going to play. Two, three. Two, three, four, five. Okay? All right. Hope that's clear enough for you. All right, I'm going to move to the next one now. And this one going to be a little dif be different. So... All right. Now, we're going to try left hand first, and that's the number five, okay? Number five, number two, okay? Excuse me for my, uh, while I was uh, writing, I got interrupted, and I uh, wrote it wrong, okay? All right, so this one, you're going to have to start on G3 for left hand. Finger five, your pinky should be on G3, okay? So, this is how you're going to play. 
Okay? And then you stop because this is rest right here, right? And right hand have to play, okay? And then left hand play again. Two, three, four, five. Four, be four beat plus one is five, okay? All right, one more time from here. Two, three. Okay? Now, right hand, there's only one note. That's E4, which is your finger one uh, of right hand playing on that. So I'm not going to play that one. I'm going to zoom out so you can see how I play both hands, okay? Okay. So, on the first line, you were playing this, your hand was over here, pinky on C3. But now, for the second line, you have to move over here now, okay? Meanwhile, your right hand still remain the same, okay? Third finger on G4 and first finger on E4. So it's gonna be like this. I'm counting the beat for each of the notes, okay? One more time. Two, three. Two, three, four, five, okay? That's easy enough. All right, let's go to the next four. All right, the next four is going to be a little bit confusing, a lot of the uh, tie here. All right, so for your left hand, you still, your finger, uh, your pinky still have to be on G3, and that means your first finger, your thumb, gonna be on D4. This is for your left hand, okay? This is for your left hand. And because this one is four and it's tied to the same note, so you have to hit one, you hold it for five beats. The same one here, okay? So C4, Play it one and hold it for five beat. So it's gonna sound like this. Two, three, four, five. And then you have three beat here. One, two, three of rest. And then two, three, four, five. Okay? All right, that's your left hand. It's simple enough. Now for your right hand, like I said, now you have to move your, um, your pinky. It was on beat four. Now you have to move it to C5. So you can play this, okay? So that's gonna be like this. Two, three, four, five. And then remember, your F4, you just play finger one. Now you have to switch to finger two. The reason for that is because you need to make the thumb available for E, okay? All right, the reason we have to move to C because that's what we have to do because they, based on the note, your hand have to move according to the note. So this one you have to move, so that means you're shifting your hand over to C5. So that means your thumb move to your F now. But you have to gain your thumb back so that you can play the next note, okay? So it's gonna be like this. Two, three, four, five. Two, three, four, five. All right, so let me zoom out. Mm, sorry. Get dizzy, look away. All right, so I'm gonna play right here for you. And you can see it was previously right here, right? Now we have to move one, one note over so your, my pinky can reach C5, okay? But then after that we finish here, we have to move it back so we can play E. Otherwise, we were in this position, we're not gonna be able to reach E, easy, okay? So to make it move smoothly, you have to think about that. So it's gonna be like this. Two, three, four, five, and now look at this. My second finger index move over. Two, three, four, five. Okay, one more time. Two, three, four, five. Two, three, four, five. 
Okay? All right, since we already zoom out, I'm going to play both hands together for you now. My left hand had been moved, right? From here to here now. And my right hand was here, now it moved to here. Okay? So. Two, three, four, five. Two, three, four, five. Okay? All right. So let's go to the next. Actually, let's see. Look like this one right here, the next four, is the same as the first four right here that you're learning. Okay? So it repeats itself. It repeats itself exactly. So I'm not going to play that again. Okay? And I'm going to play this one for you. And look, yeah, this last four right here. I'm going to zoom it in. Okay? The last five. Okay? All right. Now your left hand still, your pinky now, still on G3, okay? So that you can play this one. All right, and finger two on C4. Two, three, four, five. Rest two beat, one, two, and then. Two, three, four, five. Okay, one more time. Two, three, four, five, one, two. Two, three, four, five. Okay? All right. So my right hand, as you can see, is still in position. Your thumb still on E4. Okay? Now, that's where you'll be able to play your second finger, which is your index, on F4. So you can play one, two, three, four, five. Rest one beat, and then you go E, two, three, four, five. Okay, one more time. Two, three, four, five. Two, three, four, five. Okay, let me zoom out. Okay, play your my left hand now, so you can see. It's gonna be like this. Two, three, four, five. One, two. Two, three, four, five. I'm count one, two because this rest is two beats. So one, two, and then play. Okay. And again, now for your right hand, still in the same position before. Now you play with second finger. Two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. All right. So let me play the whole song for you now. Like I said, um, it's probably easier if you shoot me an email and I'll send you this material so that you can learn on your own, okay? But I'm not on the, on the thing that I uh, send to you, there won't be a finger or the note. I expect you to learn that, okay? Because real music, they don't write the note down and they don't write the finger down. You just have to figure it out. Uh, but using this video to help you write it down, okay? All right, so I'm going to zoom out because that's also give you as a homework as you're writing it now, um, it makes more sense to you when you start playing them, okay? So I'm going to play the whole song for you now, okay? All right. Two, three. Two, two. Oh, that's a three. Let me play again. Four, 
five. Okay. All right, let's play one more time. quite long enough and uh, if you have any question please feel free to drop the question in the comment section and I will try my best to respond back and also um, if you need this please shoot at me email but you need to go to the description of this e uh, video and read the instruction and do it uh, correctly as I requested you to do so if you don't do that I won't be able to recognize the email and I'll just dump it okay because there's so many junk email in my inbox. All right. Good luck uh, with uh, your journey of learning the piano. Okay? And uh, God bless. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.